changed. So obviously, you don't know everything what's going on behind the scenes. Yeah. I can tell you they couldn't figure out what they really wanted to do. It first started out with uh, Elijah Burke being my manager and, and that sort of thing. Then it turned turn around to, you know, me being like his bodyguard. And then it turned around to us being a tag team. And then it went back to him, you know, they in. You know, they had went through a, like a couple networks. They had a network, and then they got rid of it. And they went, you know, I, you know, from USA to CW or some of that. And then they had to reintroduce us. And it's really, it never really took off. I, I don't know what they, you know. Obviously, I had my matches against the Scotty Two Hotties and the Mad Hardys, and you know, a few different people. You know, a couple, um, you know, uh, independent, you know you know, some dark matches and stuff. They had a couple guys that, you know, I did some small spots with. But, um, you know, it's one of those things to where as I was supposed to work with The Undertaker and with Batista, and, um, you know, I have the passport. I was supposed to start a program with The Undertaker in the Philippines, and he put the kibosh on that. And I later on asked him what happened, and he said he had better matches with smaller guys. So, you know, I ended up working with... Uh, uh, Kennedy, and for a while, and they, you know, we just, uh, we just, um, uh, it's it shame. In my opinion, I think you could have drew good money. Yeah. Right? Oh, know, absolutely. Those things, if someone of that caliber doesn't, you know, want to do a program with you, then he's not going to do it. Hey everybody, it's Morty. It's Brian. And thank you for watching today's episode of Developmentally Speaking. If you could, please click that subscribe button. And don't forget to punch that bell icon so you can get notified whenever we go live or drop a new video every Monday. Well, thanks for watching guys, and we'll see you on the next Developmentally Speaking.